Mm-mm-mm. I love me some hardcore battlefield, but uh, I found a way to street fighter it. Ultra hardcore battlefield one remix combo. <laughs> How much more hardcore can it get? Turn the HUD off and live. Before turning your HUD off, talk with your doctor first, as it can induce rage quitting. But before we get started, I want to give out a few quick shoutouts and give a rundown of what hardcore is. Thank you, HP, for the Omen Gaming PC. It's got a water-cooled GTX 1080 inside of it, and no matter what I throw at this thing, it eats it for breakfast, which is the only reason why I'm able to play and record this video at 4K 60fps. Love you guys. The major thing to remember about BF1 Hardcore is that bullets do 200% damage. You don't regenerate health. Friendly fire is active. There is no kill cam. There's no 3D spotting, no minimap spotting, no name tags, and no kill cam. This next thing, super important, so listen closely. You hear that? That's the sound of me getting a kill. That's the only way you're gonna know if I get a kill, so pay attention to that noise. Anyway, let's start the show. Ultra Hardcore Battlefield 1. What was I thinking? Playing the hardcore game mode with no HUD? I have no crosshairs. I can't see the objectives. Literally, I can't see anything. There's nothing on the screen. Why did I think this was a good idea? And a regular squad couldn't even help me. You know? I need the whole coordinated strategies thing. With teammates spotting enemies left and right. That's the kind of help that I need. Not a little four-man squad. No. I need a team. And I don't have it. But at least I can bust doors open. I got that going for me. I don't have anything else, but I can bust doors open. Makes it feel tough. And we're gonna need that. We're gonna need to feel tough. If we're gonna be able to beat this enemy team with no HUD. Uh, that was fast. Okay. If we don't want a team to hate us, we gotta start going after objectives. We gotta start pulling our own weight. And yes, I realize that we can't see the objectives, but as long as it looks like we're making an effort, that Hopefully, fingers crossed, will be it. Cross will be it. Holy cow! They got Babe Ruth on the enemy team. Hey, bada bada bada! And he kicks our face in. I am not gonna rage quit. Uh, this could be a really bad idea. I got you, fam! Don't worry about it! Going out on the bridge, no support. Go! Oh! Mm, there it is. Who oh, didn't see that one coming? Okay, I think he's gone. I'm getting jumpy. <laughs> I don't know why I did this whole no HUD thing. This city is getting bombed out. We got enemies all around us. I don't even know where they are. I just know that they're all around me. The only thing that's keeping my sanity right now is the fact that I have played this particular part of the map a million times thanks to the fact that this part of the map is also a team deathmatch map. That fact, along with the fact that I am playing this on a GTX 1080 inside of an Omen gaming PC, which means this is running about as smooth as George Clooney does in his action movies. <laughs> yes. Anyway, I don't know why I did a no HUD thing. I will never do that again because that was a mistake. How is it a big mistake? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That almost gave me a heart attack, but that was a friendly. And, and, and I just killed him. Mm. Am I going to play no HUD again? No. No! It's beautiful. 4K, buttery smooth, 60 FPS. It's amazing, but I just killed my teammate because I couldn't tell them apart in time. Oh, sh see, see, that one was an enemy! And I am dead. Hey! Kill from the grave. Now that's a morale booster. I always enjoy seeing beefly friendly units heading to steamroll the enemy objective. You're gonna do great, buddy! No, he's not. Enemy anti tank is legit. And apparently, so is their infantry. Luckily, we got a few friendly units to back us up this time. And I decided to roll with the MP-18 for a little bit. It's almost the Mondragon of the Assault Class. Obviously, the Hellrigel 1915. That is the true Mondragon of the Assault Class. But I'm maining three classes on two different platforms. Coming some slack. Hopefully, that's what the enemy's going to do. God, these guys just keep coming. Holy crap. Okay. Uh... We're doing pretty good, you know, keeping our wits about us, but we, we can only keep this up for so long. Let's get out of here. Let's turn tail. I think we're going to... God damn it! I knew it! Just let me walk away from what? If you can't bring your enemy out of the building, bring the building down around the enemy. General So, 
the art of chicken. So we finally got some treads. <laughs> you guys know I like my light tank. Oh yeah, hop on top, man. Go ahead, tank surf me. I like my treads, but um, with no HUD, I should have stuck a piece of gum to the middle of my screen or something, because I just have no point of reference. Where's the middle of the screen? I don't know. You try finding the middle of your screen. You can't. Finding the precise middle of the screen is nearly impossible. Especially when you got the screen moving like a turret and they're reviving each other. What? Oh. Roadkill. I'll take it. Very good. None of you guys get in my way. There's friendly fire. Friendly fire. Uh, that's gonna haunt me. Oh, I feel bad about that. Beautiful map, though. Really cool. It's like playing whack-a-mole, but with uh, British soldiers. <laughs> All I'm saying is, if they make another Spaceballs about the sequel trilogy of Star Wars, which they should, <laughs> I want Tom Hanks to play Snoke. Hear me out. It's, instead of a hologram, it's just Tom Hanks acting like Tom Hanks sitting in a chair. And when Kylo Ren and General Hux come and talk to him, <laughs> <laughs> He's just Tom X. <laughs> That's all there is to it. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> that would be beautiful, but we should really get out of here. Oh, that's a lot of assault. Oh, he actually had his anti-tank weapon out. <laughs> How about I just back on out and go home? Yep, I'm just going to go on home. How about that? Where well, there's milk and, and cookies, and the only thing hardcore is my film collection. The tank is gone. It's just gone. And that's all I'm going to say about it. You may discuss the ambiguous ending of the tank amongst yourselves down in the comment section, but I am moving on to the armored car because the armored car is the way of the future. It's going to carve our victory through. Hey, hey, it turned out better than I thought it would. I'm better at aiming without crosshairs in this thing. Oh, oh, I had such high hopes, just like my parents. And here we see the apex predator of Battlefield 1 within its natural habitat. Of course, we are talking about the alleyway. Seriously, alley- Oh, Okay, alleyways are kill boxes, all right? They are bottlenecks, they are dangerous, and I can't think of anything that's ever been more dangerous than alleyways in Battlefield. <laughs> I really can't. These things are deadly as hell. And, uh, I gotta go after another objective. Problem is, I just don't know which one's the objective. I would have rage quit long ago. Let me tell you, I've been playing a lot of No HUD Battlefield 1 tonight. And it has been insane. Absolutely insane. Thank God that heavy tank is friendly. Otherwise, I would be long dead already. But, uh, yeah. Um, it, this game is just such a complete joy to play with the rig that I'm playing on. Like I said, it's as smooth as Ryan Gosling in the movie Drive. And if you've seen the movie Drive, you know that man is smooth as silk. Hey. Oh. <laughs> yes! I never get to do that. Oh, and I did it in 4K 60 FPS. Whew. Battlefield 1 moments, guys. Oh my god. That was amazing. Now we just gotta wait for the enemy. Oh, wait. Hey. Wait a second. Oh, thank God, it's a friendly. You don't know how relieved I am to see you. Ah! And so the alleyway claims another victim. The voracious appetite of nature knows no bounds. Damn, nature. You scary. And so, oh my God, run! No, no, no! Thank you, Brick. Thank you. That was a teammate! What? Oh boy, here I go alleywaying again. I just never learned my lesson. Still, this map is like 90% alleyway. Hey. As long as he doesn't have any friends. Hey, you got any friends, man? <laughs> oh shit, he does. Well, no. Uh, grenade wasn't helpful at all. That's just great. At least we have like perfect cover. As long as we stay in here, we're forcing them to come to us. We're gonna be safe. Damn it, they're burning me out. Smart. 
Sky alleyway, beautiful alleyway, cloud alleyway, photogenic alleyway, safe alleyway, Time Magazine look at alleyway, damp looking alleyway, dangerous looking alleyway. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. <laughs> I came to the wrong neighborhood. The German High Command had another severe lapse in judgment and gave us uh, another tank. That is a lot stronger looking than it is. Hey. Hey, that is that is a heavy tank. That is a British heavy tank, and I have no crosshairs. Panic! Panic! <laughs> hey, we actually hit him. Okay. Maybe this isn't going to so, be so bad after all. I mean, he hasn't hit us once yet. We, we've at least hit him. And he's got crosshairs, for all I know. I don't know, maybe he's playing no HUD too. Maybe he's a masochist, just like I am. Hey, it, it ricocheted! I hope if he gets a shot on me, it ricochets. <laughs> so, if the angle is severe enough when your shell hits the enemy tank, it will ricochet. And the more ricochets, the less damage it deals. In some cases, it deals like no damage whatsoever. That does a double ricochet. That's f***ing awesome. Ah, crap, we're getting hit. I mean, he's taking a lot of damage. I think he's even starting to smoke a little bit. Yeah, he's got some fire. He's got some fire. If we keep this up, if we hit him hard enough, he's not going to last much longer. His treads are out. He's a sitting dog. He's wounded. We just need to move in for the kill. Beautiful. Far out, man. Far out. We didn't have any crosshairs. We had no HUD. We were able to take that guy down. Mm. Mm. I couldn't have made that happen better. That's a dream come true. And now, next thing that happens, we die. <laughs> we're on our high horse. And then we just get knocked right off. Oh, sh Oh, my God. What? How did that not hit him? Oh, that's a limpet charge. Oh, we're dead. Duh! Dum, 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 dum. This is when he starts to lose all hope. Where's he gonna go? <laughs> See, he's gonna rage quit. I almost rage quit a few times, but this is like a guaranteed rage quit. Hey, where's he gonna go? There is nowhere he can go to escape this drain. If he tries moving before I disable his his motor, <laughs> he's not gonna get very far. He's gonna get a little. He's trying to. He's try and he's disabled. Yep. Yep. <sighs> Them's the brakes. That's how. That's how she rolls. Trying to fix himself a little bit, but we'll get him. We'll get him. Before this archway blocks us, mark my words. And with the last shot. Beautiful! Oh! <laughs> Replay that. Oh! 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 Hey, 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 I saw that. I saw that. Stab it! Stab it! Stop the car! Stab it! All right, I either stop it or move up enough for me to get a shot inside of the actual alleyway. It, it looks like I'm shooting at nothing, but I'm trying to create an impenetrable wall of bullets that he cannot escape from. Just a wall of death. Uh, move up, let me shoot the alleyway. You know what? Stop! 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 Wait for me. I'll... Oh, shit. Dude! Oh! Dude! Alleyway man's got my back. He slayed him. He, he took him out. He was long dead while I was still shooting. Awesome, man. The Wehrmacht soldiers, they're on point. Well, I mean, technically they're not Wehrmacht. It's World War One. whatever. You know, for a war zone, this is a really, really clean floor. <sighs> Apparently it's got invisible dust, because that guy was kicking up a, a crap load of it. So, it's a, it's a war zone. It's a cleaner floor than mine. All the doors and windows are blown open, even. Uh, hey. Did I see that? Yes. Yes, I did. Come on. Damn, man. Those bullets had to travel through two panes of glass. Still hit their target. All right, grenade, make me proud. I'm a proud papa. That was a spicy grenade. That was a spicy meatball. I'm gonna take this out of the way for the Germans. As long as there's no more British, I'm going to take it for the Germans. <laughs> but you know what? Let's take this out of the way right. Let's not set ourselves up for a rage quit moment. Let's, let's not do that. <laughs> Seriously, though. I thought I actually thought that I was going to have to, like, um, just walk away. Now, I've been playing for a while. I have played many matches. 
before this match, for instance, with no HUD on, just recording, you know, have- Oh! Gah! I avenged him! Is that as good as saving his life? <laughs> anyway, uh, man, it's just such a joy to play this game with the GTX 1080. Uh, it's, it's just so beautiful. So, even when Kenny kills me, even when Kenny team kills me, I'm not gonna rage quit. I'm having fun! I am! Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, man. Was that who killed him? Was that who killed- Oh, no! No! Not, I guess not. I guess not. I'm going this way. I'm going this way where I'm gonna survive and there's just gonna be a big ball of cherries and we're gonna have sandwiches and good times. Cause that's what it's all about. You know, you just come, and, come home from the war, you just wanna have sandwiches and good times. You know, and also being alive because, you know, sandwiches don't taste that good if you're not alive. This is so much fun to hip fire this gun with no HUD. I mean, it's just such an accomplishment. Whenever you get even a single kill, just a single kill, is really, really exciting because uh, it's, it's tough. It's, it's tough trying to make it work this FB18. Wait, I thought there was someone up here. Huh. That's weird. All right, alleyway. What kind of bad guys do we have? Anybody? The British are here some... Wait, nope. Saved by the bell. Now they can't kill me and take my teeth, replacing their wooden ones with mine. Very good. You made it this far, which means you have a comments achievement. You can leave a comment about this achievement. Congratulations, but if you want some more Battlefield, check out our video on the beauty of Battlefield 1 in 4K 60fps, or join us where we play with our subscribers in our own very custom subscriber server, where it's going to be me versus you on PlayStation 4. We have a lot of fun with that in our live streams, and I'd like to give a special shout out to HP Omen for partnering with me on this video and sending me the Omen PC, which is a bombing PC, I love it! For one thing, it allows me to bring you videos like this in 4K 60fps, but also, no matter what I throw at this thing, it just eats it alive. And it makes it into a, dis a scrumptious, delicious meal, a feast for my eyes. And pairs really well with my 144Hz monitor. But once again, YouTube fam, until I see you on the battlefield,